Hey guys, it's Dan the Medic. Welcome to the channel. Now today, I'm here on the Norwegian Escape cruise ship over at Bermuda. That's why right, guys, we made it. So just an update guys, I have found out why in my previous video, it smelled like poop. Turns out that, what? You should be ashamed of yourself. This is a food and travel channel. All right, guys, so where were we? Yes, why did it smell like poop? As it turned out that while at port, the toilet system, which is a vacuum-based system, operates intermittently. So if you take a big dump, you will see that the toilet won't flush. Guys, don't ask me how I know this. Right, so we're here in Bermuda and let's go and take a look at Bermuda from like the top deck. All right, let's check it out, guys. All right, so we're here on deck 17, second from the top and boy, Bermuda, check it out. This is it, guys. Let's take a look. So over here, is what appears to be an old fort where they fight off the pirates of the Caribbean or whoever else they were fighting off at the time. All right, so this is the forward part of the ship. Let's head down to midship. Here we go. As you can see, while at the dock, the employees are making good use of the time doing little repairs and refinishing and stuff like that. Pretty good, guys. Now, this over here is a jogging track for people who want to jog while they're on the cruise ship. Usually, the only people I see jogging are the children who will take advantage of this over here and just like go crazy running. All right. It is looking pretty nice today. They got a big screen, a couple of hot tubs, that sort of stuff over here. So let's check out Bermuda from the back of the ship. Yep, so we got Bermuda. We got another cruise ship right over here and more Bermuda. Let's check out the other side. And here we have more Bermuda. Guys, I'm telling you, it is like Bermuda. So I'm going to stay on board today and I'm going to get myself something to eat over here at their Irish pub called Oh Sheehan's Bar and Grill. Oh Sheehan. Check it out. All right, guys. We're seated over here at Oshihan. All right, so this is the menu. Hi, how you doing? Do you like any drinks from the bar? Uh, do you have uh, the free drink? Here we have iced tea lemonade. I'll take the lemonade for free. Okay. Free guys, free. From the menu, I'm gonna get the, it's looking good guys, the soup of the day. 
I don't care what soup it is, I'm gonna order that as well as the Wubin corned beef sandwich and I'm gonna try their tavern battered fish sandwich and of course I'm going to get the apple pie it comes with a la mode all right very good guys hi I am ready to place my order terrific so I'll take the soup the Reuben, the fish sandwich, and the apple pie. That would be all. Uh, I told the guy earlier, yeah, for the free lemonade. It is free, right? Okay. Thank you very much. That's why I had it written down. And we have here the tap water, which is surprisingly good for a cruise ship. Well, not that I've been on other cruise ships, but you know, my expectation was that you know it's tap water that's being held in some rusty tank, but it's actually quite good. <sighs> tap water, guys. Thank you. And what's the name of this soup? Beef what? Beef vegetable. Beef vegetable. Thank you very much. All right, guys. The beef vegetable soup. I've never seen a beef vegetable soup so thin. Check it out. This is some really thin soup, guys. And the vegetables are raw. Well, not totally raw but it needs a good 40 more minutes of simmering. Not for me guys, five. Thank you. Oh, thank you. I like lemonade. I think this was meant for a different table. Cheers, guys. Woo! It needs sugar. So, while we're waiting for the food, there have been some comments below. Now the comments are saying, Danny the Medic, why don't you gain weight like it's been a few I'm just thinking to myself like wait what kind of question is that I don't I don't quite understand the question I mean like is it not the same for all humans on earth for example but right, you got a guy he eats something the body uses that food right and then so if that person eats more food than the body uses, he gains weight. If he eats less food than the body uses, he loses weight. And by weight, obviously we're talking about body fat. So if you think that, uh, not, not you, but whoever left those comments, were thinking, uh, Danny the Medic, why don't you gain weight? That's uh, that's what's happening. Uh, I, I don't know what else to say. What? Oh, uh, hi. Thank you. Oh, terrific. All right. Thank you very much. Okay, wow. 
It's looking really good, guys. It's looking really good. Check it out. All right, first, the French fry. Hmm. It is good today. Very freshly made. Hmm. Eight for the French fries. Now this here Ruben. Now, uh, it's okay, 7.5, but I feel like they're a little skimpy with the meat. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna open the sandwich and move all the meat to one side. Give it a try since I have it open. That's pretty good. I'll give it an eight. All right, now we have a sandwich. Mm. 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 And now the fish sandwich. It looks like they just took the fish from the fish and chips and put it on a bun. fish and chip sandwich guys it's nice and flavorful bun is nice and soft I'll give this a 9 pretty good guys They did a good job on this. Now, apple pie. Guys, in what universe is apple pie a rectangle? A rectangular apple pie, guys. It looks more like a, a piece of moon cake, you know, Chinese moon cake. There's steam coming from my apple pie.
It tastes like an institutional apple pie, like the filling might have been made in huge vats in the institution, and then you know they pour it into the pie separately or something like that. It is like very thick apple sauce, hot, thick apple sauce, kind of like that. I don't know what to think about it, guys. You see, I'm an American. You know, it's all about the apple pie. I'm gonna have to give this one a six. Now, a little bit of ice cream. Oh, nice vanilla flavor. Mm. Eight for the ice cream. All right. Thank you for watching the video.